counter those in the rest of the European Union who say, you know, Greeks shouldn't get more money because you have squandered your money? Do you have, uh, do you lead by good examples? I heard that, uh, that the city of Thessaloniki is the first one that put the previous mayor in jail. So how did you decide as a new administration who came into being during the crisis to lead by a good example? Well, yeah, you're right. Uh, the previous uh, mayor of Thessaloniki was uh, sentenced life in prison because there was a corruption of about uh, seven, uh, 17, one seven million euros. Well, this was the money of uh, the citizens of, uh, of Thessaloniki and we are really sorry about uh, this thing. So now it's not only the European money that is uh, so difficult to absorb it's uh, a, a huge bureaucracy and a huge uh, and a very long procedures in terms to accomplish a European project. And on the other hand, I can tell you that there is a, a, a very uh, strict procedure in, in order to uh, uh, get uh, an approval of all the projects, even they are with. Uh, own uh, uh, money, you know, money that the, um, uh, the municipality takes from taxes and uh, state funds. That means uh, even if we wanted to, 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 you know, to do something uh, nasty with this money, it was, it, it was not possible to do that. But I can tell you that now it's uh, so difficult to uh, implement implement any projects because it's a huge procedure and bureaucracy in terms to uh, invest, uh, build, construct, and on the other hand to hire personnel. This is another big issue that we cannot hire the personnel personnel that is uh, needed for uh, uh, the implementation the applica the application that we would like to. Uh, perform in the municipality during our administration.